What's up guys? I created a new GPT called the get any job resume prompt. And I'm going to show you how freaking easy it is to use this GPT. You literally copy and paste your job description that you're looking for, and it's going to spit you out the perfect resume. Super simple. I'm going to show you how it works, how to do it. Let's get started. So in the first video, I broke down exactly how the prompt is made, how I made it, uh, all the back end stuff, but now I've made it even easier. You guys don't even need to know any of that stuff. You simply find the job you want, plug in the job description, and that's it. And it's free. I'm not even asking for anything. Just give it, you know, give a like. Give me a like. Give me a something. Give me a comment. A nasty one doesn't matter. Uh, put something in there. So I'm gonna show you how this works. First, let's find a job that we want. I've always wanted to work at Apple. Let's go to Apple Careers and just find a job, whatever, application. All right. They always have these super long pages. Where are the jobs? Where are the jobs, huh? Why do they do that? Oh, here we go. All right. Um, what do I, where do I want to work? I've always wanted to be some kind of an architect. That thing is higher than architect. What are the competitive jobs? Okay, let's do hardware. This should be better. Acoustic technologies, architecture. Here we go. I found my niche and there are no fucking jobs. You got to be kidding me. God. All right. I found a much easier page to navigate. Hmm. U.S. business expert. Let's go something like this. IT risk management. Here's the summary. So here's we. once you found your job, all we're going to do is copy. Uh, we don't need the pay benefits. I'm just going to copy this. And we're going to go into my prompt uh, for this. I will leave a link in the description. Feel free to use it. And also just tell me how it works. Tell me if it's good or not. Uh, haven't used it in a bit, but I'm making updates to it every time. So all you need to do, just what I copied, what I copied from the job application, send and in short order, it's going to give me a perfectly worded resume. So while it's going, I'll tell you a little bit about the prompt. Uh, I've set it up to pretty much give you kind of a running start in the resume process. Sometimes even myself, uh, as a creative or as a marketer, I don't even know what to write on these things, right? And this, you know, the the back end of this, I have a few articles that were resume best practices. I've put them in there. I've made it so that they are creating a kind of a character uh they've created a essentially kind of a fake person whose job would be best aligned with his job description so it's just a way for you to understand kind of how to phrase your resume so you can take all of this stuff copy paste and build it that is closer to uh, what your experience is and if you look very short sentences conduct risk, uh, risk assessment i didn't even really read what is this job about? Let's see if it actually matches up. Business compliance group uh, looking for a driven IT <clears throat> audit or, inf or uh, information security professional to join our team. Candidates have experience with SOX. I don't know any of this stuff. I don't even know how, how am I supposed to know if this is good. It looks good. Uh, dedicated IT this is professional summary. Over five years of experience in big four firms. So see, it's kind of throwing it in. Specializing in SOX. Ooh. <clears throat> PCI. Uh, blah, blah, blah. And then here it says senior IT auditor at whatever random job, conducted risk assessment, control group, control gap analysis for diverse IT systems leading the implementation, blah, blah, blah. And another one here, another one of best practices I remember, always include some kind of statistic behind your role and behind your, you know, add an accomplishment into a responsibility that's always a good uh good word of advice collaborated cross-functional teams that's kind of a standard I've, i see this like cross-functional teams on every single freaking and once again 25 percent reduction and then so on and so forth so it looks pretty good but again guys that's how freaking easy it is just copy put it in there and it's a great start to the resume process that's it Please tell me if it works. If it doesn't, let me know in the comments. I'll fix it. Uh, enjoy, guys.